Greetings, everyone. My name is Dr. Edgar Lampkin. I am the CABE CEO of the California Association for Bilingual Education Exec Chief Executive Officer. And I want to share with you one of the reasons why we oppose AB 2222. We in California have done major work in putting together a comprehensive and robust one of a kind ELA ELD framework. English language arts, English language development framework that is aligned to our English language development and our English language arts standards. There's a lot of work and a lot of investment that has been put into doing this work. And we started implementation for three to four years prior to the pandemic. When the pandemic hit, as many other things went by the wayside, I believe across the state of California, the implementation of the ELA ELD framework also kind of went by the wayside. What we need to do is we need to take and we need to invest our monies, especially during these hard times, in helping our teachers get retrained in the implementation of the California ELA ELD framework. It's robust. It not only includes the science of reading, in other words, instruction in explicit instruction in systematic phonics, but through a meaningful context, as well as, like I said, the science of language, the science of writing, the integration of all of these components so that we can have our students, our diverse group of students in California, have their needs be met by the experts, our teachers with the tools and the resources that they need. Right now, we have AB 2222 Rubio Bill that is attempting to have a one-size-fits-all, an approach that is appearing to be a magic bullet because it's the science of reading, when in reality, we already have that in our ELA, ELD framework. We do not need this bill. We do not need this kind of investment. Instead, let's focus on investing in our teachers and getting them retrained in the California ELA, ELD framework so that we can implement effectively our ELA, ELD standards. The alignment is there. We don't need a magic bullet. We don't need AB 2222 Rubio Bill. Thank you.